This year's South Bank Sky Arts Award for TV drama goes to It's a Sin. <laughs> Thank you, thank you very much. That's amazing. Shooting new all the time. Um, thank you very much. This means a lot. It's such a serious subject to talk about because a friend of mine wrote to me uh, after the series had gone out and said, she simply said, we sent our childhood friends home to their bedrooms to die while their parents hid them from the neighbours. She said in one line, what took me five hours to say. And it was an honour and a privilege to write about it. And we know these members of the beautiful cast know that we stand on the shoulders of the activists and the researchers and the families, the people with HIV, the people with AIDS, the people we lost, the people we loved, the people who learnt, the people living now in this situation. It is an immense privilege to be the ones briefly representing them. It's also worth saying, while I've got this stage, this was made by Channel 4. <laughs> Public Service Broadcaster dedicated to making this sort of programme. We know that the government has said they're going to sell that off. I know the government's wounded at the moment, but it's like a wounded dog. A wounded dog bites everyone, and the rabies will spread. It's still in danger. They have said they're selling Channel 4, and they have said they're stopping the licence fee by 2027. And we have to realise that the things the Tories say they will do, they do. They're very good at that. We're full of doubt. They're not. They will do this. It is wrong. I know I'm kind of trying to speak into the converted, but there's money in this room. And if there's money in a room, that means there's Tory voters in here. <laughs> it does. You are here, and you're certainly watching at home. So please know, you are voting for murderers, bastards, abusers and liars. <laughs> <laughs>